and I'm going to quickly walk you through how for OEMs that want to pre-install the office onto new PCs. First thing you want to do is you want to go out to oem.microsoft.com which will take you to this page and then from here this is where you can download the OPK for Office 2013 slash 365. There is also a pre-installation guide that will give you a lot of detail on what I'm going to quickly try to cover. From there, once you download that, you burn it to a DVD. And uh, I've done that, and I've got that DVD in my drive. I'm going to show you what it looks like here. This is what you get. Um, it, it's for Office version 15 and uh, the UBI, the out-of-box experience folders, all that's in there. All you got to do is this is a little batch file right here. So you would throw this into the, the computer, um, the customer's computer, and you can, I typically right click and do run as administrator. And this one is already set up. Um, before I hit yes, you can see that it's got EN-US, that stands for English-United States. There are other country codes you can use. Um, it's a language country code and, uh, and uh, English for for the US English language. Right now it's running the batch file. It also says there's no referral code given. Referral codes are for very large OEMs that um, sell lots and lots of systems and they get those from their direct Microsoft account manager. Most OEMs uh, won't have those codes, but the batch file has the ability to add those codes in there. As you can see, the it's launching and it's running now. And this might take a minute, so I'm going to probably pause the video for a second and let it continue. And you can see it continues to install all the Office products onto the system, giving the user actually access to the whole suite because at this point you don't know which version of the Office the customer purchased. The idea is to get the bits installed on the system and ready for a customer to to uh, try or to activate. And from there the installation finished. So I'm going to show you what that did. So on this computer when the user clicks on the start button there's now an icon here that just says Office. And again it doesn't say which edition, it just says Office. So um, the user can now click on this icon and they will be taken to this screen here which gives the user three options they can buy a copy of the office they can activate a copy of the office or they can try office 365 for a 30-day trial without a credit card actually so if if they don't own a copy of office they can click buy and it will take them out to the web so that they can buy a copy if they've already purchased a copy and they have the key code you can click activate and you would type in your 25 digit key code here. If you're an OEM and you're doing it for them, you could actually uh, activate this on their behalf and I'll probably have a second video that goes into deeper detail on that specific method. But for now, just know that's where they would type in their key code to activate it. Let me launch that again. And if you want to try, it's gonna take them out um, to the internet And this is where you can sign up for the trial. And what they would do is they would click on the, the free trial and put in their options. And there is an option to get a 30-day trial uh, free for a month, no obligation, no credit card required. Thank you for watching. Watch for another video that will go a deeper dive into a situation for an OEM to pre-install and activate a product on behalf of an end user before they ship to them. Thank you, guys.